There's the bald guy, just forever happy. Always ready. Full work! It's Yamper! Yamper! Hello, Yamper. Looks like my Yamper really likes you, huh? Anyway, we've run into each other at, at a good time. You know the m mural here in Stow on site? It's said to tell the story of the hero of Galar. and didn't look like it told any story to me. As well. Though, what's there today is actually a replica. Oh, okay, so that's why. It looks bad. Of the ancient art that used to be here. You tend to have surprisingly sharp insight, so I was wondering what you might think when you see the ruins. Kaboom! I knew it was gonna explode. I knew it. I felt it. What? What in the world was that? Sounds like it came from the direction of the ruins, too. Let's have a look. Come along, Yamper. Yep, yep, Yamper! Wait. I guarantee my Pokemon aren't healed, or are they? Okay, they are. Good, I don't have to do an extra step. Oh, why'd you stop here? What's going on up there? Oh, damn. What is that, Pokemon? What's the- is it the elephant? DESTROY IT! DESTROY IT ALL! WE'RE GOING TO FIND THOSE WISHING STARS! We've got to bring the chairman more wishing stars if we want to please him! Kabaraja! If you're truly the Chairman's Pokémon, then you should feel grateful for this chance to help him find Wishing Stars! The elephant doesn't want to do it, man! Alright, oh, never mind. Oh my, you again! So you think you can start collecting Wishing Stars now and get in the Chairman's favor? That's the way of things, is it? I see. So you do have some, some cunning in you. But I won't have it. I won't allow anyone to stand in my way. All right, fine. I'll just whoop you again. Duosion. Well, I don't think water moves are going to be effective against this thing, but we'll use it anyway. I did fine damage. Hm, I've already seen more than enough to judge you and your team's abilities. Uh-oh. Okay, that hurt. That didn't feel very good. I forget what a lot of these Pokemon are by the, just by their names. Oh, okay, so the pre-evolution of that was that like party hat looking thing. Unless it's maybe maybe that's just a different type and there's just like different looking ones. I don't know if it's the evolution. It might be. My partner's move is simply splendid, wouldn't you say? What is it? Is, is it gonna hurt? Please don't hurt me. Okay, well, it's not super effective. We good. Gotharita. I think I know what this one looks like. 
Yep. Just keep using Drill Peck. It is the way. A ponytail. Oh. Oh, wait. No, I think I'm good, right? It's still like half fire, I think. Cause I, I think I remember going against a ponytail before. I have to win this for the chairman. Do you really think y'all let me? <laughs> it just doesn't want me to finish text, does it? Okay, it's just effective. Whatever, that's fine. I know there was a Pokemon I used before and it was like super effective, but I don't I don't remember what I was using though at the time. Oh, that might as well have been super effective though. Just annihilated that pony. I'm sorry, I defeated you again. <laughs> This has to be some kind of mistake. I demand a do-over! No do-overs. But why? How can this be? How can someone like you get in my way? I was the one chosen by the chairman. I was the one who was to defeat the champion. I'm one of the elite, someone who can shoulder the, the future of the Galar region. Challenger Bead. Oh, it's Olena. Challenger Bead. <laughs> I like how I didn't like change the voice there at all. I wondered what you were up to when you asked to borrow Chairman Rose's copper. I can't believe you tried to use the Chairman's Pokemon to destroy a historical site. But it's not the real one. Who cares for some ancient rune when the next thousand years are at stake? Did you stand in the path of the Pokemon Simple Beam or something? How do you expect to the sport the support the chairman with that sort of thinking? Young Bead. I thought he was just gonna say nothing. It pains me to have to say this, but I'm truly disappointed. It's true that I am the one who found you, but when you were all... Back when you were all alone, he adopted them. I saw talent in you. You reminded me a little bit of myself back when I was young. That's why I sent you to a trainer's school, to give you a chance at success. But trying to destroy the mural, part of Galar's history, you show no love toward Galar. You are clearly not a worthy challenger for the gym challenge. Oh, damn. We will decide what to do with you later. For now, you will return to Hammerlock. Get punished. You... You must be joking, right? You're disqualifying me from the gym challenge? But you're the one who endorsed me! There are a hundred different ways we could sort this out. Why are you choosing the worst possible option? Challenger Bead, I will be taking those wishing stars that you have gathered. Get wrecked. Ah, uh, Sonia and Opixer too. Ah, uh, yeah, you just notice us now, huh? Terrible shame, all this. An absolute disaster. I never wish to see us lose challengers for this sort of reason. Yet we do what we must to keep things fair and sportsmanlike. Okay, bye. You know, during one of Bede's matches, I heard the announcer say that Bede has no family. Apparently, it was Rose who took Bede under his wing, and so Bede was battling for the chairman's sake. What an awful turn of events. I hope the mural survived all that. It did. It looks the same as it did before. And all its, uh... 
glory? Question mark. Black screen. Oh, he destroyed it. What is that? Oh, it's a shield. I heard a doggo. Oh, there's the the the, the two doggos. This is like giving me a uh, Twilight Princess vibes. She's got it. She's got something. Not a brilliant turn of events, but the ruins were brought into the light for us to see. What does this tell about Galar's legends? A sword and shield? Right, more than any hero, there's those things that appear to be Pokemon that stand out. Not just that, but those Pokemon appear to be holding a sword and shield as if they were using them. Anything else look interesting to you? Hero was uh, the same as the tapestries? Oh, good observation. There really were two heroes, but if that's the case, then why only the one statue at the Budu drop in? Well, there had to be an ancient trainer. I mean, well, there's two back there. More than any statue of a hero or odd tapestry, these ruins made it in truly ancient times must show us the real truth. Which means... Uh, the, uh, the, okay, the sword is a Pokemon. Yep, I was thinking the same thing. Oh, what is this mu music? It sounds like it's warping. Seems like at some point in history, the sword and shield were combined with the two actual Pokemon and treated as the same thing. But then what? They just faded from history? Two young heroes, the sword and shield were actually Pokemon. But why would the truth of these ruins be hidden when their stories were uh, depicted in artwork? With your help, I really feel like we made a big discovery here. Thanks! I'll give you a couple of these so you can uh, keep giving it your best in the gym challenge too, okay? Guess you'll be headed to Balon... B Balon... Lea next, right? Balloon? Two revives, okay. Also, can I inspect anything up here or talk to someone that would... The statues that were hidden behind Stoneside's famous mural, they depict two heroes and two Pokemon. Ooh, what is this? The hero was actually two people and a Pokemon? I feel it was more artistic before it got destroyed. Uh, no, I think it's better this way, honestly. That young lady, Sonia. She's, she's researching the truth about the ruins, right? Could she be the granddaughter of Professor Magnolia? She is. Sir, excuse me, you're in my way. A diglet makes such a weird noise. All right, so I need to go to Oh, yeah, it gives me a marker too. So I got to go through the forest. Oh god, it's so dark. Hello? I don't like it, it's creepy. Hello? Devil Pokemon, hi. Oh, okay, bye. 
Hey, this is creepy. I'm gonna get off my bike. It's not time for spooky things. Ah! Shenotic? Touch. Oh, it lights up. A big root. Can't see going this way. I will. Is that a chef? What are you doing out here? Bag of bright powder. Mm. Save that for later. Alright, we definitely have to fight him though. Hello! Cook me some soup, please. Are you looking for mushrooms? They give off light when you touch them. Derek. Oh crap, I forgot to check the uh the PC thing. What does swapping cards even do? Will I switch my Pokemon? I will not. Yeah, I probably should have swapped. No! I got lucky. They drained me. Huh? Oh! Scary. Pluck should be fine. Giga Drain. Scary face. No. Even though it's a, it's eventually gonna have a scary face. Oh my god! Wait, you still got more Pokemon? I mean, I guess in this forest you kind of need a bunch. All right. Well, I guess we're drinking tea on this one. Way better than coffee, by the way. No one can change my mind. I got no XP from that. Hey, a strong trainer. That's rare than rare mushrooms. I'm the best of mushrooms. Oh, his final evolution. Now he's not going to look so awkward. Now he's a sniper and a spy. Intellion. 
James Pond. I like it. Finally, because I, I did not like their second evolution. It has many hidden abilities, such as fingertips that can shoot water and a membrane on its back that can use to glide through the air. Oh, so he's like, uh, like Batman. With, with finger guns. Secret agent Pokemon. Snipe shot. Well, I have to learn that. And obviously it's going to be water type. 80 damage. User ignores the effects of opposing Pokemon's moves and abilities that draw in moves. Allowing this move to hit the chosen target. Oh, the perfect sniper. Uh, I mean, at this point, I should just get rid of Bind, right? Probably get rid of bind. Ta da! Snipe shot. Ah! Two and one. All right. This th this is gonna be my favorite one. I already know what it looks like, but this is like my favorite design. Dude, look how cool that looks. Look at that boy, he's big, he's grown up now. Raven Pokemon. This Pokemon reigns supreme in the skies of the Galar region. The black luster of its steel body could drive terror into the heart of any foe. As it should be. Steel Wing. Might want to learn that. Raise my defense, too. All right, 70. Goodbye, Peck. Touch this one? Yes. Oh, hello. Hi! Ah! An imp! Impadimp! Mystic water. Oh, I'm almost dead. Uh, I'll throw a Noe bat out. Maybe I can. Get it down some health, and I'll actually catch this one. And yeah, this is like another Pokemon design that kind of looks a bit weird in the Pokemon universe. Well, I don't know what it is, so we'll just throw a thing at it. Don't sucker punch me. My poor, my poor baby bat. One more should be good. Oh, I can't. Okay, wing attack then. Hold! I, I always, every time I play games on my Switch, I always mix up X and Y. Because I'm so used to other controllers.
I don't like its name either. Impidim. Impidim. The Dimadome. Owner of the Dimsdale Dimadome. Through its nose, it sucks in the emanations produced by people and Pokemon when they feel annoyed. It thrives off this negative energy. That's kind of gross. That's gross. Send him to the box where he must reside forever. Ooh, shiny. Like me some shinies? I should probably heal Intellion. Wow, I'm lucky I even have some paralyzed heals. I feel like I'm playing Luigi's Mansion 3 again. Being in this area. Uh, hello? Oh, a double one? I should be fine. Hello! The railways are amazing! They can carry lots of people and Pokemon at once! I came to ride a Galar train. I like trains. I wonder if meeting you will change my life. Uh... What? Daring couple. Why, why would meeting me change your life then? I wonder if this game's gonna have any weird dialogue like Alpha Sapphire did, because this one chick in that game's like, I want someone to put me in a ball too and order me what to do. It's like, whoa, okay. I'm gonna I'm just gonna slowly back away. Oh, I have to use this, uh, so it's super effective. Snipe the nine tails! <clears throat> Oh, oh, dude, he does it so cool. He doesn't even have to look. That's a quick fight. A good way to forget the trouble of this loss would be to ride the train. Oh, they really do like trains. Too strong. Guess I'll look for someone I can actually beat. Uh, a baby. Try that. I, I don't think they give them Pokemon though, so probably be looking for a while. Touch. Hello? TM Snore. Oh, I didn't want to run into it. I don't want to catch a mushroom. Yeah, there's a lot of dark stuff. I'm surprised there isn't any uh, of those uh, mushrooms that look like Pokeballs in this forest. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't know there was a ledge there. I want to battle you. Hello. Why, why are you hanging out in a dark forest? Some mushrooms react in interesting ways when you touch them. Yes, and some just completely knock you out. Indeed. 
Isn't there like two versions of this Pokemon? Oh no, I think it's like the male version and the female version, they look different. Let's snipe them. Take out the maid. The boy maid. Butler, if you will. Alright, now I'll just pound you. That should be good. Pop! Crunch. Like me some crunch. Probably just replace bite. I mean, flinch is good, but that does more damage and it decreases their defense, so we'll do that. Another one. Oh, is this uh, gonna be the female version? Nope, both male. She got two butlers. Snipe him. Ka-chow. Rip. Man, it's gonna take so long for Noibat to evolve. I need to just start throwing them out more. Maybe put them in the front. Oh, no, don't play nice. Come on. <laughs> Madams like me react in sad ways when we're defeated. Wh why do you look happy then? What? That doesn't make any sense. She's hiding something. <laughs> 